Hey guys, Ben Place here. Welcome to FTB Sky Odyssey. I'm gonna attempt the hard island. The hardest island. This is gonna be a real trip. If I lose a single slab, game over, man. As I said, if I do manage to get myself established, it'll feel super rewarding. But in order to get established, I need to complete this quest, storage. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight slabs. Plus four is twelve. Plus sixteen is twenty-eight. Dang. You really do need every single slab. Don't you? This is going to be a, um, this is going to be my attempt at, um, I'm going to attempt this for a half hour. I'm pretty sure this is impossible. Not entirely sure. Okay, this way, if I fall with slabs in my inventory. I think I actually got it. I almost jinxed myself there. I think that's it. I think that's a failure already. I might still be able to salvage this. Okay, that's a fail. That's actually a fail. Okay. Yeah, I don't even care about naming it at this point.
Okay, so slash set home doesn't work. Set home is not a good strategy. Now I am going to get this eventually. I have to get this eventually. Okay. Okay. Shoot, I should have done slash home. I should have done a slash set home anyway. Okay. I think I've got a strategy. This is freaking hard. But this is the one map I haven't figured out the answer to. The other hard maps I have figured out. So as a general rule, the hard maps are hard until you figure out one little trick. So I hope that's the case for this. So let's set our home just in case we get stuck on one of those things. Oof, that five minute cooldown though. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay. <sighs> nice. Nice. Okay, I have to wait forty eight seconds. Whew. Okay. This is going to be a long video. If I lose this run, then I give up. And you'll get a video of just failing. Okay, get 
I hope I get 12. Yes. Okay, so I'm taking advantage of Vein Miner. Okay, so there's a three-minute cooldown on that. I'm so close to being able to do this. Is there a way to check the cooldown <clears throat> without actually running the command? Well, items take five minutes to despawn, right? So if I just spam the slash home command once I get over here. Okay. Ah, 60 seconds. There's a lot of waiting in this video. Please tell me the items don't despawn. Please don't let the items despawn. I know it takes five minutes, but oh my god, do I get nervous about items despawning. Come on. 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24. Oops. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one, go. Come on, give me twelve. Nice. Okay, I think I'm actually good to go now, perhaps. Okay, cool down three minutes. One minute, 43 seconds. It sucks that you have to use the slash home command. But, meh. I wonder if I could do this without the slash home command. Okay, four, three, two, one. Look at that spam. And... Okay, gonna break the cobblestone slab in the middle with my fist. So that I can do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ha, who needs a crafting table? Not me. Nice. And there's dirt in there. Okay, what? 
type of sapling should I get? Oak. Okay, remember to teach dirt to the transmutation tablet. Oh, cobblestone's going to be an issue, isn't it? See, that's the next hurdle. Oh, but that's why that's why they give you a furnace. Okay. Cobblestone's going to be quite the hurdle. And now we begin the game for real. Marble is easy enough to get, so then I can make the marble crafting table, which I will place down right here at this corner. And, um, if you don't know how to what I'm doing, I can't actually describe it. It's muscle memory at this point. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four. Akashic Tome. You can select a guidebook, and then you can shift plus Q to throw it out and get the actual book back. And then you can throw it in there. Now you can do that for all the books. So if I get one Akashic Tome, I can just spam this. Boop. 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 But I don't want all these books. I'm only interested in the Draconic Evolution Information Tablet because it's worth the most DMC. The rest of these books can go bye-bye, and if I ever need a guidebook, I can just craft another Akashic Tome. Like a soul. Alright. So now... Collect that. Okay, I have to be careful what I spend my hard earned cash on because these, um, hmm. Oh. I could buy a beast coin miner and hope that it gives me more than 500 coins. 691, that should be enough for, yes. Iron ore. Redstone ore. Okay, um, Crusher. I need to get a Crusher of some description. Okay, I need to get a pl proper platform.
Actually, oh no. Rip. You know what, just for the sake of decoration, I'm going to cheat myself back some of those stairs. All right. I feel like I deserve it after what we went through. Stone stairs. I can't believe I've actually succeeded on this map. Okay, I prefer oak wood. Spruce wood would be nice too. Don't lose the crafting table. <laughs> Not that it matters actually. Ancient stone. You can't get ancient stone. Where do you get ancient stone from? Crusher. Ah, cobblestone's an issue. Cobblestone is indeed an issue. That requires cobblestone. <laughs> oh dear. Now I have to go through what, um, macerator. Hmm. Now that requires a piston. I'm trying to see if there's any crushers that don't require cobblestone. So far I'm seeing none. Nope. All of them require cobblestone in one form or another. Shucks. Coal generator. Okay, that's... That requires lapis. That's out. That one's out. That one's also out. Okay, please tell me furnaces. Please tell me there's a furnace that's craftable without. Cobblestone. Loot crate opener. Let's make the loot crate opener. Of 
request book, teach it to the transmutation tablet. But it requires a stone pickaxe. Dang it. Crate opener requires a stone pickaxe, doesn't it? Yeah, and there's no other way to get stone, is there? Smooth stone. Huh. Oh no, but I I need lava. Let's see, lava, is there a cheaty way to get lava? From obsidian, but obsidian probably needs to come from lava. Blaze mesh works. Blaze rods. Blaze powder comes from where? Yeah, that requires glowstone. Oh boy. Okay, looks like this is going to plague me for a little bit longer. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's just get our furnace. I can work on, I can get a forge hammer. Let's see. I was going to end off the video, but I'm not done yet. As soon as I get my first diamond, I can make a diamond chest transporter. Let's see. What about water? Is there an easy workaround for water? <laughs> no. Hmm. Well, I think Atomic Reconstructor is the logical next step. Hmm, maybe not. Loot Crate, maybe? Hmm. How many points is a... That's 500 points for a drop of evil, which I can't afford right now. 500 points is 500 points. Is there a sneaky generator I can make that will run a beast coin miner so that I can... No, not really. Copper, gold, tin. Gold, copper, tin, stick. Gold. Copper.
tin. So that cost 300. And I'm guaranteed to get at least 350 for that, so I'll make it, I'll get a net gain on the coins I spent. But I still don't know how to get cobblestone. <gasps> oh. Shoot, maybe spending all those points was a mistake. But I don't have access to grass yet, so I can't make glass. Or glass, I mean, not grass. But I can make the crescent hammer. And possibly the flux configure? No. That's going to require it, yeah. Ooh. Okay, the intern maybe? Nah. That requires bones. What if Fumi Doodle? As my friend would say. Have I made a mistake? We're going to stay here. Okay, I have to pee, so I'm going to mull this over while I'm in the bathroom. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, I'm going to think off camera of how to get cobblestone. Alright, I'll think it over. See you guys in the next episode. Peace.